Okay, this is Steve Grubbs from Victory VR. Now, imagine that this is a, and it actually is, a page from a science book. How do we make science books come alive? Well, using augmented reality, a student would hold their phone over it, and suddenly we have a cell. And you can see the cell is in 3D. So you can look around, you can look up, you can look close, but we can also build information and teaching inside this AR learning experience. So what you can't see is that my finger is now going to reach up on, is going to reach up onto the screen of the phone. It's going to touch this green thing right here and learn what it is. The mitochondria are like the power plants of a cell, producing all of the energy that the rest of the cell needs to do its job. I'm pausing it. Now we have a little information button and it pulls up some additional information so that I can learn the, oh, it's mitochondria. And now we're going to look at underneath, we're going to look from down here and I'm going to press this thing in the If the nucleus is the town hall, the nucleolus is its mayor, creating all of the orders in the forms of ribosomes and sending them out to the rest of the cell. The vesicles are like little transport trucks, moving everything that needs to be moved in the cell. That ranges from the proteins and chemicals created by the endoplasmic reticulum to the waste that other parts of the cell create. So that's how we make textbooks come alive in this day and age, and it's how we make learning more interactive and more interesting and fun.